In the early 1960s, some enterprising residents of Douglas Valley tried to build a neighborhood ski area in the west end of the valley. Evidence of the ski tow structure they built survives to this day. A Department of Defense map of the Academy identified a ski tow in the far southwest corner of the Academy Reservation. Documents discovered in the McDermott Library's Special Collections Branch contain information about the effort covering the period September 1961 to December 1962. Planners obtained permission from base leadership and, using non-appropriated funds, built a platform atop the east-west ridge and began clearing some ski runs to the north. The documents outlined a grand plan for this neighborhood project. In late 1962, however, the effort was abandoned. Reasons included a lack of snow, difficulty clearing paths for runs, and problems with the rope system. Despite its failure, skiing has always been a part of the Academy. In 1964, Academy personnel organized a ski club to develop, maintain, and support skiing and other winter sports. USAFA had a varsity ski team from 1958 to 1972, which trained at the now-closed Broadmoor Ski Area. While the Academy no longer has a varsity ski team, it does have competitive cadet clubs devoted to downhill, cross-country, and freestyle skiing and snowboarding.